my parents emigrated from Sicily, from Aquaviva Bladeni in the 60s, early 60s, uh, and went back and went to the UK for a better life. Uh, my parents had four children, three girls and one boy, which is myself, and um, it grew from there. Uh, it was always their intentions to come back to, to Aquaviva, but the, uh, as children grow and we all grew up, we wanted to stay in the UK. But in 1979, my parents decided to come back to Aquaviva, and we all came along because we were very young. Uh, at that point, I, I was here for approximately uh, four years. Uh, and here, I was here, as I say, for four years, but I, I, I got, it wasn't life for me, so I decided to return to the UK when I was 15 on my own. And started a life there. I went to, I went to st uh, stay there with my uncle. And then my parents came back two years later. Uh, in 1990, I decided to buy my own truck uh, and started to do transport. Uh, and slowly, slowly, from one truck, we uh, built up a company called PCL Transport, uh, which we ended up with 270 articulated vehicles, 1,300 staff, uh, and this, co this company grew and grew, uh, which I sold two years ago, which I was very happy with. Uh, and now I'm in property, developing uh, property, flats, buildings in, in the UK and London. Uh, and that's basically what, what I do now. Three years ago, um, I went out and I was looking for some Sicilian cakes. And I went out with my daughter for Christmas, just the uh, day before Christmas. and wanted to buy some gun nails, fresh gun nail and things like that and I couldn't find anything fresh everything was frozen so we, we came up with the idea of Nonna's Kitchen which we um, created uh, a Sicilian restaurant Sicilian ice cream, Sicilian cakes, gun nail, everything as, as fresh as possible and we, all the ingredients we uh, ship from, from uh, our warehouse here in uh, Aquaviva. So everything is as fresh and organic as possible and original. We try to employ as many Sicilians that, that come over from, uh, from, uh, from Sicily as possible. And it's going very well and now it's been three years and we're very busy all the time. I probably come back here 12, 14, 15 times a year. I have a warehouse in Sicily, in Aquaviva, which we collate all goods um, from, from various suppliers and we do transport for, for suppliers and ourselves back to the UK. Um, we started Sic Sicily.co.uk, which is a great website for the whole of Sicily. So I'm putting more of my efforts into uh, growing the tourism in Sicily. Um, the site has 1,500 hotels, many restaurants, and we're growing and growing and growing um, that site. We want to work with as many Sicilian companies as possible to develop the, their business into sicily.co.uk. I'd like to thank everyone in Aquaviva who helped build the site and people around Sicily and people from the UK that helped um, their input in the site. Uh, with my wife and my children, they, start, they, they liked it here, so we bought a house. Uh, and we renovated the house, and we come back every year two, three times. Aquaviva is very small, as we know, it's approximately 900 people. Uh, most of the people uh, that emigrated, there's probably eight or 9,000 in the UK. So it's as original as possible. There's no high rise buildings. It's going back 50 years, which is great to see. A lot of people are happy with the sunshine, the beaches and the good food, which you can't blame them. You know, sometimes we come here on holiday, but they've got this every day. Sicily is a beautiful island and I think it needs to be developed with the right people and to show everyone around the world what beauty 
we have here in Sicily. But look at the video on our site that we, we made around Sicily and you can see the beauty. Uh, if they've got information, just email the site so we can put that in. The more you give us, the more we can give you back.